Assalamu alaikum. Allah has mentioned many beneficial foods in the Quran. Tamar, or date, and Najla, the date palm, are mentioned 22 times. In fact, the date palm is mentioned more than any other fruit bearing plant in the Quran. It's mostly referred to as a food source. With it, He causes to grow for you the crops, the olives, the date palms, the grapes, and every kind of fruit. Verily, in this is indeed an evident proof and a manifest sign for a people who give thought. But they are also spoken about in reference to the cycle of the moon. And the moon we have determined for it phases, until it returns appearing like the old date stock. A reference to dates also occurs in a parable on the punishment of Allah. Extracting the people as if they were trunks of palm trees uprooted and a date stone is referenced in how just Allah is in His punishment. Have you not seen those who boast of their righteousness, even though it is Allah who grants righteousness to whomever He wills? They are not wronged even as much as the husk of a date stone, if they do not receive righteousness. It is also mentioned in a threat made by Pharaoh against the magicians in the Quran, Surah Taha, verse 71. Thanks to modern science, we can now understand more deeply why the Prophet, peace be upon him, encouraged us to eat dates on so many occasions. It was narrated by Ibn Umar, may Allah be pleased with him, in Bukhari, that the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, There is a tree amongst trees that is similar to Muslims in goodness, and that is the date palm. Dates are highly nutritious too. But like any dried fruit, they're very high in calories and must be consumed in moderation. Dates contain a number of vitamins, minerals, as well as dietary fiber and antioxidants, all of which have their own amazing health benefits. The NHS says an adult needs around 30 grams of fiber a day to lower the risk of heart disease, stroke, type 2 diabetes, and bowel cancer. The Prophet, peace be upon him, advised his followers to eat seven dates a day. In a study done, 22 participants were given seven dates for 21 days consecutively and saw a massive improvement in their bowel movements. And because date paste has more fiber than refined sugar, you may want to trade it out when baking for a healthier sweet treat. With the global rise in type 2 diabetes, Healthcare professionals promote the use of things like dates, which are high in fiber and low in the glycemic index, which means your blood sugar doesn't rise sharply after consumption. The American Chemical Society examined the properties in dates and concluded that they contain certain antioxidants that may reduce the risk of several diseases, such as heart disease, cancer, Alzheimer's, and diabetes. Antioxidants protect your cells from free radicals, which cause harmful reactions which might lead to disease. Although studies on the effect of dates on brain health have only been done in animals, the results are noteworthy. Mice-fed dates showed better memory, higher learning ability, and less anxiety-related behaviors. As dates contain flavonoids, they are considered to lower inflammatory markers, which are associated with diseases like Alzheimer's, and lower the activity of certain proteins that cause plaque on the brain. Some other health benefits relate to childbirth. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told Maryam, may Allah be pleased with her, when she was in pains of labor, Shake the trunk of the palm toward you, and fresh, ripe dates will drop down onto you. Reports show that women who consume dates in late-term pregnancy had significantly higher cervical dilation upon admission than non-date fruit consumers. So they are a great addition to your hospital bag as they contain natural sugars which help maintain energy levels during childbirth. <laughs> Bone health is another potential health benefit, as they contain phosphorus, calcium, potassium, and magnesium, which have all been shown to improve bone health. So, with dates having so many potential health benefits, it's no wonder the Prophet, peace be upon him, spoke about them so much. Oh.